already i have given in telugu but so many wants in english i don't know fluency of english i will try to give in english step by step so many people's wants all steps but it is very difficult to give single episode uh, i will give step by step in simple way total steps it is it is take uh, the steps to learn it takes nearly 7 to 10 days full time in our institute course and online it will takes 15 days course so i will explain how to uh, repair dead laptop motherboard first step 5 volts and 3.3 volts this is u44 tps 51120 this is v regulator 3.3 volts pin number 19 uh, pin number 21 5.5 volts um, without pressing power button this voltage will come out from this ic this is first step we will see at U44 IC U44 U44 IC uh, we will check here voltage uh, 4.9 volts 4.9 volts so 5 volts is okay next 3.3 volts see here 3.27 that means 3.3 volts so first step is okay when first you connect adapter or battery and you should check here at 5 volts and 3.3 volts regulator ic this is 5 volts and 3.3 volts regulator ic if this is okay or not you should check here this is si o chip after that 3.3 volts comes to this ic after pressing power button this rsm reset and s5 voltage come out from this ic if this voltage will come out from this ic sio and bias chip is okay this is power button we will short this button and we will check here 3.3 volts will come now we will short this one and this voltage we will see this voltage oh, right. 3.3 volts is okay rsm reset and s5 voltage is okay now bias chip and sio chip is okay this is second step when you press power button you should check at sio chip rsm reset pin 3.3 volts is okay bias okay when you press power button this s5 enable voltage come out from 3.3 volts this 3.3 volts come out from this sio chip and this will goes to 5 volts and 3.3 volts regulator s5 command comes to this ic to this regulator this voltage will, that 3.3 volts come out from this coil this is see here 3d3 s5 this is s5 voltage this voltage goes to ich you will see here 3.3 volts is okay 3.3 volts is okay we will see at coil no voltage at this point after pressing power button this voltage will come without pressing power button this voltage will not present when you press power button this voltage will come bias and sio chip is okay now i disconnected s5 now i will connect s5 connection this voltage will come after s5 command i will give s5 command see here 3.3 volts is okay 3.3 volts is okay 5 volts no 5 volts but in some sets this voltage will come no voltage at this point that is memory supply no voltage at this point and this voltage also no voltage at this point we will give step by step commands next s4 command we will give 
S4 after uh, memory supply will come memory supply will come S5 command, S4 command comes out from this IC, this is ICH, this voltage goes to that is memory supply. This voltage comes to this IC, this is outputs and this regulator IC L26, this voltage come out from 1.8 volts S3. S4 input command, S3 output will come, come here, this voltage goes to memory, memory slot and GMCH. S4 command we will see in this coil. See here 3.3 volts is okay. At this coil 3.3 volts is okay. Next, see at that coil 5 volts. Maybe. See 5 volts. 5 volts. Okay, sir. 5 volts. Uh, 4.7, 4.8. Okay, 4.9. Uh, this voltage is okay. 3.3 volts and 5 volts is ok. Now we will check re, uh, memory supply 1.8 volts. 1.8 volts. At this coil 1.8 volts. 1.79. Memory supply 1.79. That means 1.8 volts. S4 command is ok. We will see in this coil. No run power. No run power here. No run power here. After S4, SLP S3 command come out from this ICH 3.3 volts supply. This voltage goes to all regulators. Now run power is okay. Now run. We will check run power. Motherboard light is on. So we will check run power. This is 1.05 volts. This voltage goes to ICH and CPU and GMCH. This voltage come out from L27 after S3 command. See here, 1.05 volts is okay, 1.04, 1.04 .04 volts is okay, run power, this is graphic voltage, this is graphic voltage, 1.1 volt, 1.09, that means 1.1 volt, this voltage is okay, 1.1 volt. This is U18. Input SLPS3 command. This voltage come out from this S0 voltage output. 1D5. That means 1.5 volts. 1.5 volts regulator U18. U18. Pin number 3 and 4. 1.56. 1.5 uh, volts is okay. 1.5 volts is okay. This is U22, SLP S3 come to here and this voltage release 1.25 volts, see here 1.25 volts, this is U22, after this POK voltage goes to CPU core, CPU regulator. This is U22, this is U22, this is U22, this is U22. run voltage, 1.25, this voltage is OK. Pin number 3 and 4, 1.25 volts. This voltage is working. When all regulators work, that power good voltage comes to this uh, uh, controller, CPU controller IC, uh, regulator uh, controller IC. This voltage come out from L42 and L45. This voltage goes to CPU. This is 1.1 volt to 1.2 volts. One point one volt is okay. We should check here. One point two volts, one point one volt CPU supply is okay. This is clock generator. We will see how to check this IC. This is mark. This is pin number 1, we will check pin number 1, pin number 16 power supply, we will check at pin number 16, see pin number 16, 3.3 volts, 
3.3 mm. uh, volts is okay. We will see VTT uh, clock good signal at pin number 63. Pin number 63. See here. Pin number 63. 3.3 volts. Okay. This IC is okay. You should check this voltage is okay or not. After this will start function, RSM reset will come out from ICH. This is mini con card connector. This is pin number 22 PLT reset. You should check here 3.3 volts is okay in Intel motherboards only. 3.3 volts is okay here. ICH is okay. See here pin number 24. Always auxiliary voltage this one. This pin always will come to this pin. This when ICH is okay, uh, this voltage come to 3.3 volts to this pin mini card connector this is mini slot mini card slot you should check at pin number 22 this is pin number 1 this is pin number 1 this is pin number 2 this is pin number 3 pin number 4 so odd members here even even members here odd members this side this last pin uh, 16 last pin 16 16 16 this is 17 uh, 17 that is 18 18 18 20 20 22 22 third pin from gap third pin you should check here 3.3 volts is there or not? 3.3 volts is there. Pin number 22. That is RSM reset. PLT reset pin. That is PLT reset pin. Third pin. From third pin. If this voltage is okay, ICH is okay. This is pin number 24. This voltage always will come. This is slot supply. This is AMD motherboard. PCI reset voltage you should check at this resistors R388, 389, 167. This will not come at uh, with this will, this voltage will not present at mini uh, card connector in amd motherboards amd motherboard there is no pci reset at pci reset voltage will not available at mini sim card we will see see at this resistors voltage 388 and 389 we will see r388 and 389 light is on mm. 3.3 volts we will see second resistor 3.36 volts that means PCI reset PCI reset is ok you will check at this resistors ok we will see at R167 also see here 3.3 volts R167 3.3 volts so RSM reset is voltage is ok that means ICH is okay. When GMCH is okay, this uh, HT CPU power good and CPU reset voltage released by GMCH. You should check here voltage is there or not. When this two this is AND gate, when this two inputs will come, this 1.8 volts come out from this place. When this input is OK, this uh, 1.8 volt come out from this place. You should check here 1.8 volts, 1.8 volts. This is U133, H power good and H reset IC. We will see at pin number 1, 2, 3 voltages. Pin number 1, 3.25 volts. Pin number 2, pin number 3, no voltage. Pin number 3, no voltage 
pin number 4 3.2 volts pin number 5 2.5 volts pin number 6 1.8 volts this is okay this is okay we will see pin number 14 last 1.8 volts pin number 13 13 3.3 volts 12 2.5 volts 11 1.8 volts this is okay 1.8 volts this is okay this is lcd panel connector when all all steps is okay this voltage will come out from gmc h 1.1 volts to 1.6 volts this voltage comes to this all pins you should check here this voltage is okay display will come no display you should check inverter connection in this connector this is in simple way it will take nearly full step by step how to start how to end i will give video in our um, online classes in my institute who is experienced in laptop card level that mechanics so seven day pass track will here seven days to ten days course there is no display we will see lcd panel connector pin number two 1.4 volts next pin number three 1.1 1 .1 volt 1.1 or 1.2 to 1.6 volts next 1.1 volt next 1.1 volt next 1.1 volt 1.1 volt next pin 1.1 volt next 1.1 volt next this is ground pin next this is ground pin next 1.1 volt next pin number 13 up to 20 up to last 1.1 volt next 1.1 volt uh, next mm, 1.1 volt 